Thank you so much for tuning back to Nevada News Live. Taking a look outside to downtown Fargo. Still some slightly cloudy and some slightly breezy ones as you can see that camera shaking. But otherwise for our temperature still on the colder side sitting at 21 degrees feels like eight here in town with the winds out of the south southeast at 14 miles an hour and even up in Grand Forks just feels like one degree with their air temperature sitting at 16 still much colder with those breezier winds still persisting gusts up to 26 over in Jamestown gusts up to 23 up in Hatlock and we're still going to have some breezier winds throughout the next couple hours as well with our cooler temperatures right now we have areas like Howlock and Bemidji sitting at the colder spot of our neck of the woods sitting both at 12 still though much colder areas of cold air in areas of Minnesota much warmer in North Dakota as we also have that cloud coverage as those clouds are acting like a blanket allowing for their temperatures to be on the warmer side and even throughout the next couple hours that cloud coverage is going to continue to make its way throughout the rest of the valley and just by nine o'clock areas of Minnesota still on the colder side still staying in those teens but even then it's going to continue to work its way through overnight tonight and we're still going to have those breezy winds from the south as well still gusting up to 25 miles an hour but by tomorrow morning things are going to be much quieter and calmer still a little warmer though most of us are still waking up in those 20s a few of us like Howlock where you're seeing a little bit of the break in those clouds are still going to be on the colder side in those teens but even then throughout your day tomorrow we're going to see those temperatures continue to warm up into those 20s some areas by just lunchtime alone in those mid to upper 30s 35 down in Ellendale starting to see much more breaks in the clouds and some clear skies in north central and northwestern part of Minnesota. Still much warmer tomorrow even by your evening planner. Still passing of the clouds in the southern valley, but we're going to get another higher level of clouds coming in from the north as we head throughout the rest of your evening hours tomorrow with a slight change in the winds as we are approaching the weekend system as well. But here's for your hometown forecast tomorrow. Like I said, temperatures much warmer tomorrow. Most of us in those mid to upper 20s and even in those low 30s, but like I said, all of our eyes are on this first alert weather day as we're headed through the holiday planner and here's what you need to know starting off Sunday night. We're going to start to see some rain showers arrive in the Southern Valley and even into areas of central part of Minnesota causing for some tricky travel as that also has that rain snow mix line going straight through Grand Forks and even some snow near the Devil's Lake Basin and that's going to continue to make its way throughout the valley as we head throughout the rest of your Christmas morning on Christmas Day. Some areas are still going to have that chance for some snow and that rain snow mix as we head throughout the rest of your Monday morning still having that tricky travel as that rain is going to freeze for our temperatures below freezing and that's going to continue to impact the Southern Valley throughout the rest of your evening hours on Monday but by Tuesday morning most of it is already gone from our neck of the woods still impacting areas near the Twin Cities but even that leading up to that system temperatures are going to be very very mild and very warm with temperatures still in those 40s 43 on Saturday day after a cooler day today. But like I said, all of our eyes are on this system as we head throughout the holiday weekend with a lot of people traveling to and from families. And then after that system, temperatures are slowly starting to decrease to be a little more seasonable. Amazing that we made it this far almost through December mm -hmm. that, by that point without any of those really cold temperatures, yes. any yeah. of those big snowstorms yes. we can see. Yes, very We're much. still staying above freezing. Right. Yeah. yeah. And Crazy. our average. Way to go, Shelby. <laughs>